Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can add a watermark over any video you edit in CapCut. So let's get right into it. For this tutorial, I'll be using this video, which is some sort of countdown from the stock video library in the CapCut application and in CapCut's library. So it will work just perfectly. And let's say I want to add my watermark in the bottom right corner. Now, the first thing you need to do is go back and create a new project. Once you create a new project, you need to go to stock videos and select green screen. Here you select any green screen which you would like. For example, let me select this one in the middle, uh, which is sort of a recording type green screen and just click add. And once I add it, well, my recording software just broke or my screen mirroring just broke. Let me just get back to you after I fix it. And I'm back. And as you can see, I have loaded up these green screen. And what you want to do here is add your watermark over it. For example, let me just add some text, which just says watermark. And once I add it, I can just click the check mark and position it wherever I would like. Let's say I want to position it in the bottom right of the screen, as I've said, and now you have your green screen uh, that is ready. And then you can just export it to your device and click save to device. And once that exports, we'll be adding it as an overlay over the video where we want our green screen or our watermark to be. As I've said, I'll be putting it over this here sort of countdown. And what you want to do here is tap on overlay click add overlay and then add the video that we've created. Now you want this video to be uh, fitted to your entire video. So let's just drag it like so. And once you're here, uh, as you can see, the watermark disappears after a certain time. That's because I didn't set it up when creating the green screen, but that is pretty much perfect. However, to create this or to add this green screen and remove the green uh, first resize it of course to fit your entire video if you like if you would like to do that and like so and as you can see there is the watermark in the bottom right and then select the green screen again and go to remove bg or background select chroma key select the green go to intensity and drag it all the way to the right you can also drag the shadow all the way to the right if elements of your text or anything are disappearing. And once that's done, just click OK. And now you can select your watermark again. As you can see, it is fully opaque and we might want it a bit transparent. Just go to blend and here you can select any filters you would like. Overlay is the best one as I have seen. Uh, and as you can see, it is a bit more transparent now. You can pretty much slide this opacity slider and make it as clear or as uh, transparent or as opaque as you would like. And that is pretty much all there is to it. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys next time.